the world's first double decker cable car the thought of riding on a cable car which soars 1900 meters up into the swiss alps might strike fear into the hearts of those who are afraid of heights but at least being encased in glass can usually offer some kind of comfort to terrified passengers and a semblance of safety for those riding on the world's first convertible cable car however even that small crumb of security won't be available opening in switzerland the cabrio rises to a height of 1.2 miles above sea level as it climbs the stanserhorn mountain near the city of lucerne and carrying up to 60 passengers at one time the innovative cable car has room for up to half of them to brave the bracing mountain air and stand on the top deck but even those riders with less of a taste for heights might not find the inside much of a refuge as the lower floor is encased entirely in glass starting at kalti which is 711 meters above sea level the cabrio transports passengers to the summit station 1850 meters up The length of the new cable car is 2.3 kilometers, a journey that the cable car will complete at an impressive speed of 8 meters a second. In total, the ride will take just over 6 minutes to ferry passengers up the Stanserhorn. And being unveiled on the very same day as the 44 million pound Emirates airline cable car in London, the Swiss version looks set to upstage Boris Johnson's pet project. By contrast to the Cabrio, the Emirates airline cable car rises to a height of just 90 meters. And instead of offering panoramic views of the Swiss Alps, the UK version provides passengers with a 360 degree perspective of the River Thames and East London. If you want to ride on this cable car, please let us know how impressive it is in your comments. For more videos, subscribe to Pastimers. Thank you.